Good day, First Institutional. These are your announcements for Sunday, July 19th, 2015. It's a big day for our children, youth, and the greater Phoenix community. The Back to School Bash kicks off following service, and we're excited. A special thank you to all the members and others who donated items. We're looking forward to a great time today in the Hope Center. We want to keep our senior pastor and the FIBC delegation in our prayers this week as they attend the Baptist World Congress in Durban, South Africa. And this Wednesday is a great time to join the entire congregation in prayer and fasting. Our prayer ministry will be on the prayer line beginning at 5 a.m. So join them. All you have to do is call 602-258-3998 and use the access code 0155504. If you can't make early morning prayer, consider stopping by the campus in the middle of the day or evening. We're continuing the Why Pray portion of our Why Faith Bible Study series, and you can join in. Pre-noon day prayer begins at 11.30 a.m., followed by Bible study at noon. Or come out for prayer worship in the Word on Wednesday at 6.30. The young adult small group study will meet in the Hope Center community room, and child care is available in the gym for children through four years old. There are some big deadlines coming up for our men and boys, so please make note. Registration for the upcoming men's retreat will close this week. This great excursion will take place July 24th through the 26th in Oracle, Arizona. This week is also the deadline to sign up for the Arizona Diamondbacks Baseball Fellowship, taking place on Friday, August 7th. And auditions for the Fall Gospel Talent Contest are coming to a close. There's still time for you to show off your talent and win some great prizes, but we need to hear from you. You can register for all these great events and get more information on our website. Just jump on www.fibcast.org or contact a men's ministry leader. We're excited to announce something new coming to FIBC. If you've recently attended Bible study or last week's church business meeting, you were introduced to our new membership portal. It's a more user-friendly way to keep up with all of you, and it puts your information in the power of your hands. You'll be able to see your giving record, manage family information, addresses, telephone numbers, emails, all from your computer or smart device. Our new portal with membership access will go live on Sunday, August 2nd, and we want you to see it. So join us for one of the upcoming demonstration sessions taking place on August 2nd and 9th or each Wednesday in August following Noonday Prayer and Bible Study. For more information, please call the church office. It's back to the Bible basics for FIBC and you're invited. So for the entire month, we're doing Bible study and worship. For more information on the why and how, check out the insert in your bulletin. Then start making plans to get back to the basics. August is also a great time for our leaders to come together for some hands-on training. And that's going to take place at the FIBC Ministries Sigmoid Summit on August 8th. Topics include cultivating cooperation and kingdom leadership. And you don't have to be a leader to attend. Anyone who's interested in growing spiritually and professionally is welcome. Breakfast and lunch will be served, so we need to know you're coming. Complete the tear-off form in your bulletin and hand it to an usher or greeter. You can also visit our website, www.fibcast.org. There will also be additional breakout sessions for the Clergy Caucus, Flight 1141, and the Media Ministry. So look for more information in the coming days. Finally this morning, Fibco Family Services has an urgent need for liquid gold. Well, not actually gold, but water. And in the desert, it might as well be gold. We hand out thousands of bottles of water each week to those in need, and we're running low on supplies. So if you're willing and able, pick up a case today and drop it by the Hope Center lobby during business hours. And thank you for continuing to be the hope of the city from the city center. First Institutional, these are your announcements for the week. Have a blessed day.